a little bit more than yesterday. A little bit. I'm not drinking the sleepy tea in the morning, so maybe (laughs) that's... uh, (laughs) It might be a little helpful. (laughs) Right. So, Amanda, I know yesterday we didn't do it. Can you just throw it to the folks before we get going? Um, what functional fitness your business is all about? I know you're here twice a week, so some people know, but for those that might be hopping on this morning or later on the replay, can you fill them in? Yeah, I want to make um, fitness fun and functional for everyone, um, regardless of your abilities or your, um, some people think that they can't afford a gym membership and that they can't work out because of that, that shouldn't matter. I want it to be functional for everyone. Um, and I want it to be fun so that you enjoy working out. (laughs) (laughs) During these COVID times that is here, you know, what we are here to do. So we make it a quick 15 minutes and, you know, definitely you can go back, you can watch the videos a few times, you can do additional reps. It's more, you know, even in the morning, if you do this 15 minutes, it's getting going. Um, And as we chatted about yesterday, what many doctors have said, many nutritionists, health physicians, all of that, is that the main thing is that people keep moving. When we sit sedentarily, if we do get a cold, what happens with it? It settles. And Mm -hmm. we need to just stay active. So even if you're not feeling good, any kind of little movement, whether that's walking around the house. Especially if you're not feeling well. Especially if you're feeling well, you should be moving. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Whether it's mentally not feeling well or if it's physically, if you have a cold, the best thing for that cold to shorten the time that you're going to have it is to get up and get moving. Yes. And so, you know, like it, like we were saying, even if it's short durations of time. Yes. Here, five minutes here. Break things yes. into. Um, we're doing a squat challenge and on another um, platform of mine. And I'm like, even if you're doing five at a time, do five mm-hmm. squats move on, do five squats or five arm lifts or whatever it is. You don't have to complete them all at one time, but. um, I always say one is more than zero every time. (laughs) Quote, so you had it together. I I love your shirt today. I know. Much more motivational than me with the New York Giants (laughs) in in Wisconsin. running low on clothes because I haven't gotten to the laundry. So (laughs) it doesn't fit like it used to before that last baby, but whatever. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. You're going to keep on moving and we're all going to get rid of our COVID-19 when this is over. Yes. (laughs) On the full 19, but. (laughs) Okay. So with that, what are we starting with this morning to get moving? So we're just going to use, um, the water bottles if you don't have weights or if you have weights you can use weights as well or in, in place of um it's up to you what you want to use well, well we're going to use anything oh yeah you don't have to use anything at all um we're going to start with some kickboxing i love kickboxing um for many reasons because it's strength and it's cardio in one um so when you do kickboxing, all you have to do, whether you're using something or you're using nothing, is you just want to make sure you have a stop point. So when you bring your arm out, you don't want to just come like this. Okay, you want to bring it out and back. Pull it back as hard as you're putting it out there. Okay, that'll work that muscle twice as hard um, as you would if you just kind of... Okay, so we're going to start with kickboxing. We're going to start with our left hand, and we're going to go jab, jab, hook and then a duck. So we're gonna squeeze our stomach, okay? And you're gonna have your hands up by your face. We're gonna go jab, jab, hook, duck, jab, jab, this one. Duck, we're gonna stay on the same side, jab, jab, hook, duck, 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 jab, jab, hook, duck. We're gonna pick it up here, ready? After this one, hook, now let's go faster, ready? Jab, jab, hook, duck, jab, jab, hook, duck, jab, jab, hook, duck, jab, jab, hook, duck, jab, jab, hook, duck. Good job, nailing it, Katie. (laughs) (laughs) We got this. Hook, duck, jab, jab, hook, duck, jab. Jab, hook, duck. Good. Keep it going. Jab, jab, hook, duck. Jab, jab, hook. Let's count down. Ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Jab, jab, hook, duck. 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 Jab, jab, h
four, three, two, one. Good. Now we're going to take our water bottles and we're going to lean back. Or if you don't have water bottles, that's okay. Lean back. Kind of bring your feet off the floor and we're going to go side to side, side to side. Good. Work those abs. I was going to say, I love these weighted ball, these, they have like mm -hmm. the sand inside of them. Yeah. Right now is a good time to look, especially if you guys are looking for equipment and stuff. So many places are having online sales. Yeah. Um, people not being out. So, you know, I got these, which usually probably sell for about $14 for like $3. Yeah. So, I mean, super inexpensive. And are they squishy, Tammy? Yeah. So these ones you can put like between, if you're doing sit-ups or leg raises or any of that, they're really, really nice. So, or even if you're working on your grip strength, right yeah so now we're gonna go to our right arm and we're gonna go jab jab hook duck same thing on the other side hook duck okay, hold on one okay. second slow it down okay <laughs> thought i had it jab yep hook duck jab jab hook duck really squeeze that stomach when you duck squeeze jab jab hook duck jab jab hook duck jab jab hook duck jab jab hook duck jab and we're talking about how it's gray here in wisconsin if you're watching how is it by you is it gray is there sun still <laughs> I haven't seen the sun in so long. I don't even remember. <laughs> you know, I'm like, I looked at the upcoming forecast. It says rain. Hook, duck. And then it says rain. Yeah. <laughs> All right, we're going to pick it up here. Ready? Okay. Duck, oh, ready? I got to jab, jab, hook, duck, 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 jab, jab, hook. Duck, jab, jab, hook, duck, jab, jab, hook, duck, jab, jab, hook, duck, jab, jab, hook, duck. Good, Tammy, keep it going. Oh. Yeah. You got it? Lungs are punching, right? Like this. Good. Five. Like four. choreography right now. Three. Stay in the rhythm. Two. One. Good. Now we're going to take our water bottles and we're going to come up into like a V shape and then down. I can Ready? do this. You I can, can do this. Look at it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Good, keep it going. Nice and tall. Good, back down. Keep those arms straight the whole time. Good. I'm kind of missing us having the kids, these early morning ones, you know, everybody's still kind of like mm -hmm, in bed. Yeah. You know, I'm sure mine will be wandering in in a few minutes. <laughs> My kids get up so early. I'm lucky if I can sleep till six. You know, they used to, I would say five or six was normal, but now mm -hmm. I feel like everything being so off and things going on and not going to bed, even though, you know, bedtime at our house is kind of the same. Like it's, I always say like, make it like, mm -hmm. <laughs> Yeah, one. Time for good. Now we're gonna come here and we're gonna swim. Good. So use those rotator cuffs. Good. But like we were talking about yesterday, it's the falling asleep part of it, right? I mean, I think yeah, we don't sleep much at our house. It's between us and all of the kids. It just doesn't happen. <laughs> Last night was actually a good night. I don't think we had any lows. Charlie came in at some point through the night, but I didn't even hear her. And I think the baby only got up one time. So, yeah, it's a rock star night. Watching, you watch, let us know. Is it gray where you are outside? Is it raining? Is it almost snowing? Is it cold? <laughs> <laughs> and now we're here, and we're going to go open and close. Like, like a chicken, like chicken dance. Yes, like the chicken one. <laughs> <dance. laughs> I'm good. Bring it up. Chicken. Knees at the top. Squeeze down. Squeeze 
down. Squeeze. Good. Ooh, this is a nice little move. Yeah, isn't it? Yeah, people are working from home. They could do this little exercise like in between emails. Oh. Good, I'm gonna count you down. Five, Woo -wee. four, three, two, one. Now we're gonna come here. We're gonna lean slightly forward. We're gonna have our arms slightly bent and we're gonna use the pivot point as our shoulders. We're gonna go up and back down. Squeezing the shoulder blade to your spine. Squeeze oh, down. Good. Yes. Squeeze down. Squeeze. Good. Good. Squeeze. Good. So my husband bought guinea hens. Do you know anything about guinea hens? What? I don't know. You're the one with a hobby farm. <laughs> what happens on the hobby farm stays on the hobby farm. They are <laughs> they are very, very, very loud. Very loud. What are um, they? Guinea hens? Guinea hens, they're called. Yeah, he's wanted them for a long time, and he bought them when I was on a girl's trip in Nashville. Uh huh. They, they just like scream. <laughs> it's terrible. Five, four. Do they stay in the house? Three, what? Do they stay in your house? Or Two. Else? Oh, no, no, no. One. Good. Now we're gonna do who my shoulders are burning. <laughs> Hold on a second. So what's a guinea hen? Like is it a like a like so a, it's like a chicken kind of, but not but they make like a noise similar to have you ever heard a peacock? Like a peacock noise? No, well you wanna make it for us? <laughs> <laughs> it's loud and obnoxious. And like if you talk, because there right now we have a chicken coop. We're gonna go out together, up. Down. We have a chicken coop built into our garage. So when they're younger, which these things are, um, we keep them in there till they get big enough to go outside. And anytime I'm in the garage, they just, it's like an alarm. They just start going off. <laughs> you can't get them to stop. And I'm like, when these things are running around my yard, what's going to happen? Like, I don't have enough noise. <laughs> <laughs> right. Does anyone else have guinea hens that's watching? I don't and know. if you don't know what a guinea hen is, look up a guinea hen and then look up the sound that they make. And then you will feel very sorry for me. <laughs> <laughs> you have chickens and goats and all those things. Yeah, I like chickens. I mean, a roosters can get loud, but it's kind of a nice loud. The guinea hens is like a awful alarm noise. It's terrible. Good. Give me two more. I think I never got that gene, like the gene to want to have a farm. I love it. Gene to ever want to have a chicken. Yeah, I love it. Good. Now we're gonna go knee, knee with our water bottles. Bring them up and bring your knee up to the water bottles. So crisscross. Oh. Crisscross. Yep. Yeah, I like having the farm. I'm not big on the guinea hens. <laughs> How many did he get? He only got four because they only had four, which wow. that thing. <laughs> yeah. I'm sure he would have gotten more if they had more. What do they do? Do they do anything like, do they provide you with any type of food or? They lay eggs, but the eggs are tiny. Four, three, two, let's switch sides. Um, yeah, so the eggs are small, so you can eat them, but, um, I don't know. They annoy me. <laughs> right. So that's all right. Life is always interesting on the farm for sure. We had to run the dog to the vet yesterday for like a quick emergency visit. Okay. She got a fish stuck in her nose. A what? Fish hook. She was in the garage and somehow got a fishing lure stuck inside of her nose. Oh my goodness. <laughs> very awkward. I don't know if I'm trying to lean like you're leaning. You got it. Yeah. For the camera. I'll just do it. It's all right. You're doing good. Five, four, whoo, three, two, one. Good. Now our last move is going to be we're gonna do left side. We're gonna go jab, upper, jab, upper, jab, upper, jab, upper. This is the part that Tam grabs the coffee and watches. <laughs> hey, I don't have um I don't have hot tea in there. 
<laughs> yeah. Upper, jab. Good. Upper, jab. Upper, jab. Upper, jab. Upper, jab. Upper. Good. Keep it going. Good. Let's pick it up here. Ready? Jab. Upper, jab. Upper, jab. Upper. Good. Nice. Abs are tight. Good. Keep your right hand up by your face. Cover it up. Good. Five, four, three, two, switch sides. Good. Jab, upper, jab, upper, jab. Good. Upper, jab, upper. Good. Jab, upper, jab, upper, jab, upper, jab, upper, jab. Up. You're nailing it, Tammy. <laughs> I'm trying to be focused this morning. You're doing great. Jab, upper, jab, upper. Good. Let's pick it up and jab, upper, jab, upper, jab, upper. Good. <laughs> it's a little more difficult when it's your opposite arm, you know? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. It's good for the brain, though, too. To right. Have to think about these moves. Right. Good, keep it going. Be careful with those water bottles that you don't hit yourself in the face when you're doing this. <laughs> that could happen. Five. It just happens in my world, I don't know. <laughs> Three, two, one. Good, and rest. Nice job, my shoulders are kind of burning. Oh, that's good. All right. Got a little guinea hen education in mixed with our uh <laughs> right i'm gonna have to go look up the guinea hens and you, ha you have to look up the noise they make because that's i mean they're interesting looking they kind of look like a turkey but the noise the noise they make okay so the guinea hens are going to be for sale on the side of the road pretty soon maybe yeah maybe <laughs> All right. Well, with that, everybody, obviously we won't be here over the weekend. So make sure that you are staying safe, staying in and staying moving. And um, we will see you guys next week. Right? Yes. All right. Sounds good. Okay, everybody have a fabulous Friday. Bye. Bye.